Well, after months of anticipation, today is finally the day. The queue line is up and running here in downtown Detroit, and our Nick Monticelli is live for us this afternoon with everything that you need to know about the queue line, how to get on board, and how much it's going to cost, Nick. Everyone, good afternoon. As is live TV goes, we were supposed to be live on the queue line showing you exactly what it looks like and how smooth the ride is. Unfortunately, that line over there is running about seven minutes late right now. So not a smoothest start on the first day here, but you've got to remember these streetcars are moving along with traffic. It's not a dedicated lane. It's not like the people move over where they will be on a set schedule all the time, but it has been a great and ceremonious day for the queue line with a ribbon cutting to kick it off. Yeah. All right, so that was the ribbon cutting just outside of Grand Circus Park here along Woodward in downtown Detroit. A lot of people showed up. You had dignitaries, Governor Snyder, Mayor Duggan, uh, you had a lot of senators, Dabby Stabenow you had out here. So a lot of people showed up because this is what they call the epitome of a public-private partnership. This uh, project, 10 years in the making, 3.3 miles, $180 million in all. And those who are finally riding it for the very first time, very excited about the possibilities that it should open up to the city of Detroit. It was needed pretty bad. I'm a very rare Detroiter that doesn't drive. Um, and I never got my driver's license and I never wanted it. And I think most major cities have some sort of mass transit. I rode the bus for many years, which is fine, but I think this is going to make a lot of things easier. Excited. I used to work down here when they had the trolley. So this can kind of bring back some memories. It will bring back some memories. So again, you're looking live right now at that streetcar. It really hasn't moved since we started our live shot, which gives you kind of a better idea of how these things are going to work. Again, not a problem. It's just the way these work when you've got streetcars moving with the flow of traffic. So what do you need to know? There are 20 different stops along 12 different locations here along where we're basically going from the new uh, center area all the way down here to the Grand Circus Park area. $1.50 to ride for a three hour pass or $3 all day long. Everett, I think I might just jump on for fun because it is kind of cool. Maybe our producer Aaron will let us dip back in and show you what it's like riding around on this streetcar down here. I, I cool. certainly hope so. And, and if not, we'll just let you wait there to catch the queue line all the way back here to the station. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> all right, Nick, thank you.